Hey everyone, what's going on? Welcome back to my channel. Uh, if you're new here, this is Kevin's Corner. I'm Kevin. Uh, I do all sorts of fun things around, you know, the whole state of Florida, mostly the central Florida, like Orlando area, uh, mostly like Disney Universal theme park stuff. Um, sometimes if I go other places and there's some cool stuff going on or something fun, I'll film there too. Uh, today is going to be one of those days. So if you have been watching my videos, I did a video on Target and Walmart's Disney sections, going to um, one that's right near Disney and showing what they have because obviously Disney prices can be very expensive and a $60 plush Mickey at Disney can be $10 or $15 at Target or Walmart and you can get big savings. Uh, so I showed all of that and I'll link those videos below as well for you to see. Today, I'm gonna to go to different stores. So we're gonna go all over. So I'll tell you our first stop. It's gonna be Kohl's. Uh, they have Kohl's all over the country. Now they might not have Disney stuff all over the country, but if you're local or if you're on vacation or uh, staying on or off Disney property, um, most of the Kohl's in the central Florida area as well as other stores will have Disney stuff. So what I'm gonna do is go to each of these stores. I'm gonna show you all the Disney stuff they have, what it costs. Um, and I'm also going to tell you where it is in relation to Disney World, so you can kind of get a good idea there. All right, so like I said, first one's Kohl's. We're going to head there right now. All right, so we just got to Kohl's. Uh, we are under 10 miles from Disney, so it's only like a 12-minute drive uh, when you GPS it from here, so very close. Um, all sorts of stuff. You can see them in like the Lego toy section. They got toys, clothes, a lot of cool stuff. So just going to show you guys everything they have uh, Disney related and if they have any universal stuff too and uh, what the prices look like. All right. So there were a lot of people in the toy section right now. So I'll come back to that. But just wanted to start off. There's some cool hats. Kids hats. Mickey. Precious cargo there. Looks like a... No. Thought it was a Tinker one, but it's just regular. Jurassic World hat back there. And these hats are $17, but right now they're $12.75. And they've got some more hats here. Same $12.75 sale. Uh, you can see Princess One, Mickey, Minnie. And then right over here they have some kids' clothes. This is going to be some girls' clothes. Very confusing because it says boys. But then they have girl clothes, but... Whatever. <laughs> uh, but then here, yeah, here, toddler girl. 40% off, so good sale. And these are the prices. Cool mini tennis outfit. Uh, looks like this is the same type of thing. It's just with a sweatshirt. Aerial swim club for a new Little Mermaid movie coming out soon. And then that's not Disney, I don't think. But yeah, got some cool stuff here. And they got more girls' clothes here. Here's the pricing. It's 25% off right now. I don't know how long these sales are going on. They don't have any signs for it. But pretty good pricing between $12 and $16. Little outfit there. And then an outfit there. So some pretty cool options. And then they also have a sale here. Buy one, get one half off of toys for babies. They have cool stuff like a crinkle book. Crinkle Mickey book. A Winnie the Pooh on the go activity, a Dumbo version, got this cool looking swirly eared mini, a mini version of that on the go, a mini plush down there, so they got a lot of different Disney toys, and they're doing the buy one get one half off, and let's see, it does not say when it ends there, so I don't know if this is always going on, but you can always check your local Kohl's, uh, see if they're doing a similar sale as well. All right, we got some more Disney stuff and our first taste of Universal and kind of Disney. More kids clothes, got Spider-Man shirt. Uh, that's kind of both Universal and Disney because Marvel is Disney, but of course they have the Spider-Man ride and Marvel Superhero Island at Universal. All these cool clothing options. Onesies and shirts. And then these ones, but they're not Disney down here. And you got all of the pricing. Here's a lot of options, but they're between 6 and $9. All right, and there's some more stuff here. 
as well and some of it's on sale down this way now you might be noticing a lot of the pricing is not very different from disney or, or it's still very expensive but they have a lot of sales here um, also if you have the kohl's credit card or kohl's cash you get a lot more discounts and also the crowds here as you can see are going to be a lot less than at disney so definitely really good option to come here see these 25 percent off so between 12 and 16 bucks captain america i really like this dumbo jumper onesie princess one cool winnie the pooh one and mickey one back there yeah this cool toy story one and then a star wars one back there so a lot of kids options a lot of kids options but now we're going to head over toward the uh, adult section and see what type of things they have there all right, and there's definitely a lot less stuff in the adult section, which was to kind of be expected, but $20 hoodies here, Black Panther and Grogu. Pretty cool. Marvel one right here, also $20. Normally $50, but they're 60% off right now. And then these are, I believe, $20. Yeah, Stitch Tank here. And then a couple of buttoned shirts. Cool Mickey one. Uh, this one has the Joker for Universal, I guess. Uh, actually, I don't think so. But yeah, still a cool shirt. And so looking around at all the graphic tees, that's actually all they have in the men's section. Yeah, I got a little mixed up because the Marvel thing is a little confusing between Disney and Universal, but the Joker one is not Universal. But yeah, still just a pretty cool shirt. A lot of cool shirts here, but no more Disney ones. So now we're going to head on over to the women's section see what they have over there, and then see if they have any home decor, blankets, anything like that that's pretty cool, Disney related. All right, so in the women's section, we didn't find anything, but uh, we're in the women's plus section now, right next to it. Cool Mickey and Friends shirt here. Princess one, Mickey, Minnie, Pluto, and then villains, female villains. This is a Grinch one for Universal. Cool, like vintage looking Mickey, Minnie there. And yeah, that's going to be it. So more shirts on this side, but no Disney ones there or there. Um, for the pricing, these are all going to be $20. But right now you can get them for $15. All right, if you're a fan of lounge flies or other Disney bags, they do have $50 ones here that are currently $37.50. Really cool gold mini one here. Looks just like a lounge fly. A couple cool purses. All of these are 50, but they're on the sale price right now. A couple down there as well. And then all these hats also are gonna be 24, but $18 right now. So you got like that hat. Down there. And a Little Mermaid hat. You're gonna see a lot of Little Mermaid stuff just cause the movie's coming out soon. And this cool stitch bag, $50. All the bags and all of the hats are the same price and they're all on sale. I'll show you that one more time. Uh, again, you'd have to check your local Kohl's to see if the sale matches up, but if you're in the area, this sale should be going on a while. And then they have a lot more clothes that I didn't show because there's just so much, but they also have some princess dolls here you can get too for uh, anywhere between $9 and $150. I guess that depends on if it's like a special edition one or not. And then now in the bedding section, they do have a lot of like wall decals here for princesses, cool decorative letter, Star Wars letter board and like coin, um, coin banks. And then they have a lot of kids like quilt sets that are really cool. This really Mickey one's really cool. And these quilt sets are $65, but they're 35% off right now. So actually it's going to be about $42 and change. And then they also have these kind of like, um, I guess it'd be a pillow, yeah, so like a throw pillow of Stitch. Normally it is $30, but it's on sale right now for $21. Cool flounder here. And then they have this princess one. Looks like it's Ariel, Moana, and Rapunzel. Any blankets? Nope, no Disney blankets here, but some really cool pillows. I think I saw some Disney blankets also, so let's go take a look. So they do have a couple of Marvel blankets. So they got this Avengers one, uh, Black Panther. They've got Spider-Man one. These are 30% off. They're normally 30, so 21. Um, cool.
cool pillow here of princesses. Got another same one right there. And then some plushes. Smaller and bigger. Uh, let's see, the smaller one is 15. And the bigger one is 40. And this is how big it is for $40. Not too bad. All right, and then the blankets that I saw are these two. Um, it is a Star Wars Mandalorian one and a Minnie Mouse one. They're normally $26, but both on sale for $17. Like I said, all these sales don't have end dates, so I think they're just on sale indefinitely. So definitely I would check all of this stuff out uh, whenever you have the ability to do so. But uh, yeah, that was everything that we saw here at Kohl's. Uh, we're going to head on out now. All right, we're now in Old Navy. Uh, this is right in the same parking lot, so same distance as Kohl's, just about 12 minutes. Found a Simpson shirt, which is Disney. Uh, gonna see what else we can find in here. Hopefully some more adult things, because Kohl's did not have a lot. All right, they've got some kids stuff here. This cool, like, black and purple, Into the Spider-Verse sweatshirt, Black Panther. It's all 40% off, and before the discount, whoops, it is 35. So, using my subpar math skills, I'd say about $20 seems <laughs> what 40% off would be. Uh, here's another cool one, same price. And we already found a universal thing. Cool Jurassic World shirt with like the leafy camo look. Um, this is also 40% off. This is kids. If it was adult, I would actually get that. Another Simpsons shirt there too. And I see a Star Wars shirt over there we'll go look at. And here's a better look at the Star Wars shirt. Really cool. It's got like all the characters lined up. Really cool shirt, which is $15. Alright, the music got really loud, so I'm going to do this quick so I don't get copyrighted, but... There's this shirt here that's mini, 40% off. Uh, that's pretty much everything. Really surprising with how little they had here. So just gonna try, let me see if there's like a mini hidden on this. Nope. So just gonna try, see what else is in the shopping center nearby, and uh, show you guys some other really good options for Disney or Universal clothes. All right, so Old Navy was a fail. They had like two things, very surprised. Uh, we're actually in CVS right now, which you might think is like weird but they have more things than Old Navy, so let's take a look and I'll uh, show you what they have here for Disney and Universal. All right, so I see two things here. They actually have a Mrs. Potato Head, which is really cool. I used to have a Mr. Potato Head growing up and would play with it all the time. Let's see if we can see a price. I don't see a price on this and it was in the wrong spot, so if I see where it was, I'll let you guys know the price. But they do, oh, right here, $10. And then this Spider-Man I just saw, I believe is this for $9. Miles Morales from Into the Spider-Verse. Cool little action figure. And they have this Star Wars Darth Vader, um, like Frosty the Snowman Funko Pop that's really cool. They have a lot of princess dolls. The Princess Fairy doll is $20 for this. Uh, this one doesn't have pricing with it, but then they have for $13. They have all of these little, you kind of see more in the back, princess dolls. And then they have bigger ones down there too. And then they also have this like mini doctor set, which is really cool. And see, I think the price is here. Yep, it's $30, which I actually think is a pretty good price for that. Now, I do want to mention CVS is not going to be the best for pricing, but it could be really convenient. So if your hotel's right near CVS and you realize we need to get a souvenir or, or something, or it's the last day and you didn't see anything they wanted in the parks, you can always run to CVS and they will have some very cool options. And there's also these puzzle crayon color books, Lion King, Buzz Lightyear. And then they also have... Right over here, it's called a Tattletale, $9, Winnie the Pooh, and let's see what the inside looks like here. Okay, cool, it's got a little book and some action figures to go along with that book, so nice. And that's nine bucks, not a bad price, that's what it looks like. And also in the wrong spot, but really cool, is they have a Mr. Potato Head, so that is awesome. So you can get both here, and not terrible pricing. I think it was like 10 bucks. it said. Not a bad deal. Um, and I do see some more stuff here. Star Wars, what, what is that? Hover Pram? Oh, sorry. Grogu and Hover Pram. So 
you got Grogu. Also back here they have Darth Vader. These are, I think, little action figures. Doesn't really say. Yeah, there you go, little action figure. Nice. So really cool. Again, a lot of this stuff, as you can see, is kind of just thrown here, so the pricing might not be, um, you know, exactly right. Let me pick that up. But you can always bring it to the front. They can always check the pricing for you. There's a Bo-Katan of the same thing. So see, it's kind of all over the place. And then a Frozen and then a regular Princess necklace activity so you can make necklaces so that's a fun thing you can do if you're gonna have like a pool slash hotel day you can get one of these for thirteen dollars and you can make five different necklaces with charms or this one has six so or it says five but looked like it was six but anyway you can make five different ones so that's definitely a really cool activity that you can do and then one other other thing they also have over here which is cool is a magic reveal sticker fun pad uh, so it's got a bunch of stickers and then uh, it's one of those things where you can color and it's like mess free and it reveals what's there. This is a superhero one, Spider-Man and Friends, and this is a princess one. So a lot of cool activities that you can get here for your kids or for the family um, uh, on your trip or if you're leaving on the plane ride is definitely going to have a lot of good stuff here. All right, and I think this is the last thing I see in here are these slippers. They have a lot of, these are super soft. They're like boot slippers. Harry Potter, it says... Slytherin and Keeper. This one has Hedwig the Owl. Uh, a few others here. These pink ones have Harry and Ron. Let's see. Seeker, Gryffindor. And these are like regular type of slippers with Hedwig. And I think that is all of the... Here's kind of a better view of them. That's what they look like. But yeah, you can get these slippers here. Here's another one with Ron. And these are going to be, let's see, $10 for the um, this style. And for the boot style, it's going to be $12. So not bad pricing. All right, so now one last stop is Publix. They have Publix like every 5 to 10 minutes in Florida, and that's really not an exaggeration. Um, but they usually have one or two uh, aisles that have a good amount of uh, Disney related things so just wanted to show first they do have a lot of non Disney things you can get like shoes and just like fun pool toys if you're getting like a rental then they have this bag here stitch bag it is $8 they've also got one that has Mickey Minnie that says love a mini one now I don't know if this is just like a regular purse type thing or if this is let's see what it says it doesn't say what it is or if it's meant for like a stroller but really pretty much use it for whatever you want ears which obviously are very expensive at the parks ten dollars here or 40 at disney so you could choose your pick there they don't have a lot but they do have a few options a uh, fanny pack this one's actually really cool and they have this princess one also and then they have some hats star wars grogu these are 13 dollars. these hats i like this one this red one with the mickey stitch chill and relax and then mini couple backpacks for $21 I and mean, these are reusable bags princesses mini and Mickey also all water sorry all water bottles down there which is really good for the parks a spray fan so you can spray mist that is not a Disney one but they sometimes sell Disney ones here a couple kids sippy cups also that are uh, Mickey and Minnie some plates Salt and pepper shakers. Might not need that if you're on vacation, but it could be a little souvenir. Stemless his and her Mickey mini glasses. A lot of mugs with the sugar spoon. That's just an Easter basket. More cups over here. And these are like the insulated ones. This one's really cool for the 100, Disney 100th. It doesn't say the price. Oh, but the price is right here. It's ten dollars. And they have some more hats down there. That that like tie dye mini one's really cool. Of course, I really like that dad one and the mom one. And then the other big thing is the plushes. So they have some mini, some Daisy and Donald, a bigger Daisy and Donald, Goofy, Pluto, Mickey, Mini, Stitch, and the prices are going to be way better than at Disney. So like this Mickey. Let's see. Do they have a price on these? I don't think they have a price listed on them. Let me see. 
No, they don't have a price listed, but I can guarantee you all the pricing on these is going to be way cheaper than they would be at the Disney theme parks. And it is technically Disney. They have, like, Huggies is sponsored by Disney. They have wipes and diapers. But Publix is another great place. Um, you can actually get these at every Disney resort. But how it's $21 for that uh, box of wipes, that exact box would probably be, like, $50 or $60 at the Disney resort. So they have it if you need it. But you can go to a place like Publix, Walmart, Target, and you can get all the same stuff for a much better price. And then the last thing, you see more wipes here and diapers. They do have these bibs uh, for your kid for $7. Very nice selection. Bunch of Mickey and Minnie ones. All right, and we are home now. So uh, we got to go to like four stores, I think it was. We went to Kohl's. Uh, Old Navy, CVS, and then Publix. So yeah, we went to four. Um, I kept them all in the same area. I, I didn't mention, but that Publix was literally like a five minute drive from Disney property. It was right around the corner in Lake Buena Vista. So, um, but you can go to Publix anywhere and any within like an hour to two hours, probably all over the state are gonna have Disney sections. Um, but all in all, it was pretty cool. Uh, Old Navy was a little shocking. I've been to another Old Navy where they had a lot of Disney stuff. So I guess it's just hit or miss. And the other Old Navy that had a lot was actually further away. So that was a little, maybe they just didn't have it this time. Uh, Kohl's, a lot of stuff, but it was mostly for, you know, um, infants or toddlers up to like, I don't know, like maybe like 13 to 15. So if you're a family or you have kids or nieces, nephews, or if you're like babysitting and you want to get them a gift or something, definitely look at Kohl's. They have a lot of sales, as you saw, too. It was really cool to see that water bottle of the Disney 100th. Um, I've never seen like Disney 50th stuff outside of Disney stores or Disney licensed stores like at Target or the you know the actual Disney store that they have at malls and stuff. Um, so that was really interesting and really cool to see the Disney 100th thing. Um, I'll keep my eye out for any other stuff like that I see. And if I do, I'll let you guys know because that was pretty cool. But uh, yeah, it was a great day. Saw a lot of different Disney uh, merch. Um, I will, like I said in the intro, I will link below the Target and Walmart videos. Uh, there was a lot more stuff at Target and Walmart, obviously. They had like aisles and aisles. Um, but I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope maybe it helped you find where you can shop to get some cool stuff. In my next video, I'm going to be going to Epcot. So Lexi and I are going to Epcot to have just a nice fun day. Enjoy the festival they have going on there. Uh, maybe do some rides, some character meet and greets. It's going to be a lot of fun. So uh, stay tuned for that video. It's coming out within the next week. And uh, please subscribe, like this video, comment if there's anything that you saw that you liked or that you'd like to see in a future video. And I'll see you in that next video at Epcot.